Now we're bringing on Anna Kate. Anna Kate, how are you? Oh, by God's grace, doing really well, Pastor Dave. Nice to see you. Hey, everybody. Well, we we were talking about uh, Tulsa. Remember Tulsa, where it all kicked off? Yes, I remember Tulsa. I remember the phone call that Clay called me a few months before the first reawakening in Tulsa. He said, hey, I'm thinking about putting a tour together, having like the most amazing Patriots. Can you connect me with some people? And I knew like, you know, um, Amanda Grace. He said, can you connect me with Amanda Grace? And then you guys all hung out as well. Like it was in D.C. And then bam, yeah. it just... Boom, 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 boom. And the Lord is just so good. It's been so much fun traveling the country, meeting the most amazing patriots. So glory to God. Yeah, it is all glory to God because these things started out as, a, you know, a patriot movement and medical truth, but it's really turned into a revival with the baptisms and prayers. But that's what a lot of people don't understand. Uh, you're behind the scenes there. How many people are praying for people in private and public? It, people, the, the normal people don't see that. No, everywhere, everywhere, every, even outside, inside, by the bathrooms, in the bathrooms, through the vendor halls. I mean, everywhere people come up for prayer. And it's pretty amazing because I was telling Clay before he even launched this, I, I, he, when he called and asked, I said, I think it's such a great idea because I've been involved in the political movement since 2016 when I got saved and I started getting more active. But there was all these patriot movements, but there was always a missing link, which was always God. Right. And, and my friends would that would throw these big political events and movements. They said, well, who would you want to invite? And I said, like Lance Wall now and all these different Christians. They said, no, 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 no. We don't want them. And um, I'm like, OK, well, we're missing these people. We, we're missing God's people to really represent the kingdom. And so when Clay said, I want to have like half pastors, half speakers and and educators and and teachers and and uh, people in the medical community, lawyers, I said, that is an amazing idea. And then baptisms with what you and, you know, Miss Amanda Grace have been doing, Prophet Amanda Grace, all glory to Jesus. It's been amazing. Yeah, I, I, I go back to Oregon. And again, it's not about the people. It's about Jesus. Um, we're just vessels for his purpose and his glory. But we were in Oregon, of all places, Oregon, that needed it. And I, we didn't even rehearse it. I came out with Lance Wallnow and Sean Boyd. And the Spirit of the Lord just took over. And uh, you could see a fog come across the entire audience. And uh, the Holy Spirit was moving. It was absolutely magnificent. Oh, it was amazing. There were so many healings, so many testimonies, so many. And I still have people reach out to me today. When you guys prayed for my husband, he was healed. Just so you know, he's still out of his wheelchair healed. I said, glory to God. It's been so amazing. Even when we went to Oregon, Oregon was one of my favorite states to go to because we had so many people come up to us and thank us for being there. They said, thank you so much for being here. We said, well, all glory to God. And it was General Flynn's idea. And there, I didn't realize there were so many patriots in Oregon. I mean, of course, we understand that the liberal cities is the problem and the godlessness is the problem but there were so many patriots that was one of my favorite states we visited was definitely oregon yeah amazing time and I, I one of my other favorites was dallas we we couldn't get a church in in the dallas area to do it let us do baptism so we went to a ymca and this woman in a ymca the spirit of the lord moved she hadn't she hadn't walked in six years got up out of a wheelchair and walked across the ymca amazing, amazing. Yeah. Do we see those miracles all the time? It's it's absolutely amazing. So talk to us about what you're up to now and how you've partnered with His Glory on these great products. Yeah. Well, you know, when I got saved back in 2016 and I was at that time, you know, I was playing poker professionally and then was on a TV show and I was living the life, but I was completely miserable. Um, but then I had an encounter with the Holy Ghost and Jesus and he showed me heaven and hell. I mean, totally a radical transformation from like an atheist liberal to like a Christian conservative. <laughs> and, you know, when I got saved, I heard, I asked the Lord, I said, Lord, what do you want me to do now? Do you want me to go to medical school? Because that was always the plan to go to medical school. And I heard the Lord say, you can, if you want to, but you're going to be doing full-time ministry. And I had no idea what that meant. And I had such a hunger to read the word and read the word. And the Lord revealed to me a year later that your ministry is not just the soul and the spirit. It's also the body. The body is extremely neglected. It's been attacked by the enemy in every which way. And this temple is a temple of the living God and we have to take care of it. And so some of it is ignorance. And some of it is that we just don't know what is in our food. We really don't know what's in our water. We really don't know what's in the air that we're breathing. So we're being attacked by all fronts. And the Lord said, I want to start digging into this technology. And at the time, Pastor Rodney Howard Brown 
was telling me about, you know, the air filters. And I started jumping into learning more and more and more. And I started jumping into chemicals and toxins, what we're really breathing in, what we're really using, what we're washing our clothes in, what we're showering in. You know, Pastor Dave, even with chlorine, chlorine's a gas. That's what they use in the gas chambers. We're not only breathing it in, right? It's going through our pores. Our skin is the largest organ on our body. Chlorine is a carcinogen. Chlorine causes a lot of breast cancer. So does aluminum in our deodorant that women use that causes a lot of cancers, uh, especially in women. And so I'm thinking about our, our eyes are taking in chlorine, all the pharmaceuticals in the water, all the fluoride, all the glyphosates, all the herbicides, pesticides, even well water is compromised, right? Well water, you're going to off stream whatever's on the local farms around you. If they're using pesticides. Those are going into aquifers underground and your well water is tapping into that water and you're drinking it, you're bathing in it. So, you know, and I talk to people um, who have shower filters. That's great. But what about when you take a bath? What about your newborn baby that you're really careful with his non-GMO food, but you bathe him in the most disgusting fluoride-filled pharmaceutical water? You're destroying his immune system. You're destroying his development process, right? So the Lord, I mean, I was blown away. The Lord showed me alkaline water, how real it is. I thought it was honestly like a gimmick, um, but the Lord said, no, that's how I design us to drink water right from the mountains, fresh water, water that's moving down the mountains. It's living. It has a lot of energy, right? And you're drinking this energy living water and it cleans your body, cleans your liver, detoxifies your kidney, cleans your blood, gives you really good mental clarity. Um, by the way, I mean, I have plants that were totally dead. I gave it pH of 8.5, alkaline water, 8.5, and they resurrected back to life. I'm also praying over it, but, um, but it's just been an amazing journey. And so the Lord said, I want you to start a company and call it healthy home technologies. I said, okay, Lord. And then the Lord also told me, I want you to start calling these all godly technologies. Dave, that's when I said, Lord, am I allowed to say that? Am I allowed to like advertise God? And I heard it again. I want you to start calling these godly technologies. And I remembered there was a prophecy, I forgot who it was, whether it was Kim Clement or someone, maybe it was a man or grace, but someone prophesied that very soon in the end days that the Lord is going to release a lot of patented new technologies, new innovations, new uh, creations and technology that are really going to help our health. And so by God's grace, I've been, I, I researched, the Lord has me researched two years, three years for e every single category, whether it be water filtration, whether it be air filtration, whether it be, um, you know, I have an all in one clean steamer. You can steam your entire house with no chemicals, just dry vapor, hot steam, right? You can, all these attachments for your whole home, your floors, your, your, your carpets, your, your even hardwood floors, your furniture. So it's been really fun uh, going down the journey of health and getting so many people really, really healthy and away from chemicals. It's so important. You know, the air machine, I've been using that. Uh, I think we have six or seven of them now. And I, uh, when, when the power goes out or turned off by mistake, I can tell the difference in my allergies, uh, it's so important. I, I swear by it. I don't get as, as uh, my, when I'm in the house, my immune system is much better because of that. And I, we do the water too, but, and we put it in the whole water system. So that's where our partnership with you is so important because um, we, we, we have to go at this with everything. It's, it's on all ends. So can you explain, let's just focus on the air filters uh, oh. air systems and water right now. And then we'll talk about my favorite is the, uh, the, the uh, vacuum cleaner. Can you believe it? I, I want one of those and a steamer. Oh. I think that's great. But let's focus on the, the air and the water, and then we'll go to uh, those other items. Absolutely. So with the air, it's interesting. We breathe about 17,000 breaths in and out a day a day. And so have you ever seen the little dusties that fly around your home? You know, you're breathing those in. Those are all contaminants. A lot of times those are VOCs, volatile organic compounds, which really come off of everything. Uh, paint, furniture. A lot of times if you're in a new home, in fact, there's a law in most states that if, if a, 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 a contractor builds a new home, he's supposed to air out the home for about four to five to six days. And why is that? Because of all the chemicals, right? They're painting. That's VOCs all coming out of the paint. You have all the glue in the new furniture. A lot of that are VOCs. Mattresses as well have a lot of VOCs as well. By the way, I have, a, I have a grounding mattress, the only grounding mattress in the world made in Italy. They have all non-toxic layers, including the fire retardant layer is also non-toxic. Normally those are all forever chemicals. So no off-gassing when you're sleeping and it's grounding you. I mean, phenomenal products. And Lord, to like put this portfolio together and with the air, like, I, like you were saying, it's so vital. I didn't realize how 
often I was coughing and sneezing at home. And when Pastor Rodney first told me about the air unit, it's called the Air and Service Pro. Um, I was like, yeah, I don't know. He said, just tr trust me, just try. So I took it home. I had three cats at the time, three cats, mm -hmm. two litter boxes. I had some pastor friends come over for lunch and they said, Anna, we're so confused. You have three cats running around. You have two litter boxes and we don't smell a thing. In fact, my wife is extremely allergic and she's not even coughing and sneezing. We were afraid to come. <laughs> and I said, well, it must be the air thing. It's working. And little by little by little, I started giving them out to friends and family. My sister has an incredible testimony. It's on the website at healthyhometext.com, T-E-C-H-S.com, Healthy Home Text. Your testimony is right there. Incredible. So she was on her inhaler 16 times a day. She had severe asthma. Dave, severe asthma. She was using her nebulizer four times a day. That was before COVID, before. So, mm. you know, you can imagine how freaked out she was. So she was really scared of COVID at the time. You know, she's like a baby Christian, still learning. I'm like, we don't have to spread a fear, hallelujah. But um, her testimony, she started using the air machine and within... Within three months, she was completely off her inhaler. The first week she used it about six times and then it went down and down and down. It's been over three years now and she has not used her inhaler or nebulizer. Wow. So it's powerful. From there, the Lord showed me the same technology, Active Pure, is also in the laundry uh, unit that no chemicals, no detergent for your laundry. From there, the Lord said, look at water. Look at how bad the water is. So I started researching what's really in our water besides fluoride and chloride uh, and pest herbicides and pesticides, pharmaceuticals. There, you know that Florida, actually, I'll start with Texas. Texas, surprisingly, is the number one worst state in the country with water. I don't know if you know that, Dave. I heard not, that. Yep. Yep. Florida's number two. Florida's number two. We have a lot of bacteria, a lot of boiler alerts in Florida because we have a lot of humidity. So we have a lot mm -hmm. of bacteria that loves to grow in a lot of different um, different places, especially our pipes. By the way, even if you, even if you, you know, trust the water, which you really shouldn't, your your old pipes. If you're living in an old house, all that pipes there as well, the, the, which have rust, which have iron in, have lead in it, that's also seeping into your water. So you, always, you also have to think about that. So you really want to filter the water that's coming into your home. And I even have an extra water filter under my sink for drinking water, right? So my shower is all filtered. My refrigerator is all water filtered. But I have an extra filtration on my sink because I'm drinking it. And then it goes into the living water machine, which makes it alkaline. So it's like the best crystal clear water you can get. So like I was saying, there's pharmaceuticals. There's VOCs, volatile organic compounds. You have forever chemicals in the waters as well. You know, there's forever chemicals. They've tested 99% of Americans that they've tested have forever chemicals, PFASs, in their blood. Forever chemicals, and those things never break down. Okay, Those are also carcinogens, right? So we have all this stuff in the water and we're drinking it, we're bathing in it, we're, we're making coffee in it. Look, I don't go to Starbucks for many different reasons. One of the reasons is I don't know what kind of water they're using. Are they filtering their water? Are they using tap water? Restaurants as well. I bring my own water. <laughs> so I'm like one of those. I have my little mason jar. I have my alkaline water in there. I mean, if I'm traveling, Dave, because you and I travel a lot, I have to say testing every water because I've tested Literally, I'm like a nerd and I, um, I'm actually going to do it on video soon too, where I test every single water. I've tested all the alkaline water in the store. Dave, do you know that it's not alkaline? You know that it's all marketing? I'll tell you why, because alkaline water lasts for 10 hours, maximum 10 hours mm -hmm. of that high energy living water. It starts to die down when you leave it in the water bottle. It sits on the truck, then it goes to the store, then it sits in the store, then you buy and then it sits in your car in the heat, right? All that living water that alkalinity has left so now it's just like just dead water i call it dead water you're drinking it there's no it's, i mean obviously you, you you know you 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 clench your thirst a bit but there's there's no antioxidants in there right there's nothing special in the water that's really cleaning your blood and cleaning your liver and cleaning and detoxifying your kidney so um it's just been like a world when i'm like lord so what do i do like how do i get healthy i don't trust tap water i'm gonna drink tap water the lord said start researching which kind of technologies are the best with water filtration. So I started digging and I noticed a lot of filtrations out there are like 6,000, 7,000, and, but they don't get rid of all the pharmaceuticals. They don't get rid of the glyphosates, which is Roundup, right? Which causes cancer. So I'm thinking, yeah. wait a second. And so, so the Lord highlighted a certain company and I reached out to them and I said, Hey, I want to, I, I noticed you guys get rid of pharmaceuticals. 
98% of our, it's hard to get rid of guys hundred percent. That's why I have an extra filter under my sink as well. The same company makes. Um, and so it gets rid of 98% of pharmaceuticals. I'm like, that's amazing. Most of these other companies get rid of about 40%, 50%. Some of them, if you're lucky, 60%, but this one gets rid of almost everything. So I flew out to the company's headquarters and I said, listen, I want to try your water. And they let me try their water. And I said, this is, this is just filtered in your tap water and with whole house system? They said, yes. Phenomenal. I, this company as well, this whole house water filtration system does not require electricity. It's not 6,000. It's not 7,000. It's 49.99 free shipping as well. I mean, I know there, there's a his glory code you can use by the way for all the products for December, for Christmas, there's 10% off and free shipping. You guys, his glory, use it at checkout. Amazing. This water filtration system does not require any electricity. Oh, yes. So if God forbid you're in Florida or you're in Texas or wherever you are, and if God forbid there's an emergency, there's a hurricane or there's some kind of national emergency, as long as they don't turn the water off, which usually they don't unless it's really an emergency, right? It's going to filter your water. You will have filtered water that you can depend on and your family can drink and know that you're covered if God forbid there's an emergency. So that's a big thing. And you save money on your electric bill. Wow. So they, we got the air, you got the water, you got actually have portable air that I know people take them. Uh, on the road with them so that they it covers like a couple hundred square feet yeah there's a mobile version of the air and surface pro it covers about 50 square feet and i take it in my car i travel with it all the time the one time i actually forgot it at home when i was on an airplane you know how you're you're sitting basically like a little sardine can everyone's yeah. coughing and sneezing that's a perfect breeding ground for sicknesses i get i always used to get sick on the airplane but I, I take my little portable i plug it in there's actually a new one which is rechargeable it lasts for eight hours you charge it at home you sit there you let it run and i'm telling you every time i take it i do not get sick by god's grace but actually one more thing i wanted to say about the water real quick i used to think that drinking bottled water was safer i'm like oh tap water is terrible i'll just drink bottled water do you know that 40 percent of bottled water is actually tap water you want to know why dasani tastes so terrible it's because it's 75 percent municipal detroit water tap water okay so you're thinking you're safer there's actually forever chemicals in there in fact the department of health does about a yearly an annual exam of the factories here's the thing the department of health will tell the factory that creates the water the water bottles when they're coming hey we're coming on september 24th 2004 24. well guess what happens around that time they tidy it up everything's clean but what happens all the other days of the year when they're not testing them right right if people walk people walking by and sneezing and coughing that's going into the water bottle you don't know what's in there right? So you don't know what's in there. So it's actually safer to filter your tap water of all the contaminants. And I want to say another thing too, reverse osmosis. People ask me all the time, what about reverse osmosis, Anna? Reverse osmosis, first of all, it gets rid of all the bad stuff, but it also gets rid of all the good stuff, right? The electrolytes, uh, sodium, calcium, potassium. The other thing too, you actually waste a lot of water. There's only one out of five gallons of water you're actually going to be able to use. And on top of that, it's not a continuous thing. So water filtration that we have, it, you're, all your water is filtered. You can take a shower, you can take a bath, you can drink the water, you can refrigerate the water is clean, right? Um, you can cook with it, it's clean. But with reverse osmosis, it's drip by drip by drip. And I've had a lot of people tell me that's a, it's life-changing to have all this water filtered throughout their house. Amazing. Yep. It's, it's the way to go. So can we switch gears now and go and talk about the pans, the beds and the vacuum? Uh, I, I love the vacuum cleaner. Uh, I'm going to have my, my, my wife is looking at it right now because we have five dogs, four dogs, and uh, we're always cleaning up messes. Yeah. So it's, it's, it's phenomenal. It's an all in one clean machine steamer. It's a steamer first and foremost. It has a, every technology I've mentioned all of it's patented. By the way, the water filter has silver in the water filtration system. Even the under the sink one is, has a lot of silver ions. The grounding mattress has silver ions as well, silver lining for grounding. I mean, super healthy. Everything is literally the best of the best. This all-in-one steamer is made in Italy. Phenomenal. When the Lord showed me this, I'm like, oh my God, this thing is amazing. One of my favorite, favorite products, Dave, and I'm glad that you said that because when I took it home, my mom thought I was nuts. I started 
uh, it was everything, it started steaming everything. It has a uh, dual boiler system that allows a continuous steam. So you literally have professional steaming in your own home. There's 26 attachments for your furniture, for your glass, for your uh, stainless steel appliances. There's there's a there's a, uh, a, a, a little brush that you can put on. Bam, cleans everything. Your bathrooms, one of my favorite, favorite, favorite features, attachments is this long, long, I maybe you can put a picture of it, but a long attachment. That's for the toilets, the bathrooms. You know, I went on Amazon and I, I know, I'm sorry. Sometimes I use Amazon. I'm going to, I'm going to admit it. And I ordered this little UV light, this little black light. And I went in all over my home and I noticed, my goodness, my house is dirtier than I thought. I went into my bathroom and I almost, I almost mm -hmm. puked because I'm like, oh my God, there's all this, like when I had friends come over and stay, I mean, like, my goodness, it's like all disgusting. It was all like high, just all glowing. So I took the steam and right before my eyes, all of that cells and bacteria and urea, whatever it was, all of it came off. And, and, by, and like you were saying, there's a vacuum portion as well. So you vacuum up any moisture left over. Phenomenal, phenomenal works on carpet, hardwood floors, everything. Absolutely one of my favorite things in the world. Save a lot of money, by the way, too. Last thing I'll say, people spend about $700 on chemicals every year. Seven, yeah. We have about 30 different chemicals under our sink. All of it you can throw out. All of it you'll save money on because now you can steam your home. Yeah. So talk uh, just in closing about the uh, the bed. I love the bed too. And, and the pans. Oh my goodness. Okay. The cookware is phenomenal. The cookware, no, no, no water, no grease needed at all to do your cookware at all. It, it's all of it is, um, well, there's, there's so many features. I know we're kind of running out of time, but there is like this, this textured grip, um, ergonomically designed for lefty righty, no, literally no water, no grease, because when you boil your vegetables, a lot of times you're changing the structure of the vitamins and the nutrients and the coenzymes. So you don't want to actually, you don't want to boil your vegetables and you don't, unless you're making a soup, cause you're going to drink the vitamins, but you also don't want to steam as well. Steam also will destroy the vitamins and nutrients. So you just have like a it's just a dead thing. Whereas with this guy, you can use medium and low heat and it cooks it phenomenally. Now, the other thing you were saying, mattress, the grounding mattress is also one of my favorites. All of it is non-toxic. Even the fire retardant layer is non-toxic, super comfortable. There's four comforts in one mattress. Literally, if you want it soft or firm, you can flip the mattress over. It's literally geniusly designed. It's made in Italy and it's also a grounding mattress. Phenomenal. You can Amazing. see how yeah. Yep. So they'll have to go check this out on your screen. Uh, and what should they do? They use the His Glory code and uh, and they get a discount? Correct. Yeah. You go to www.healthyhometechs.com. Use His Glory at checkout. I've never done 10% off because these products are, they're high quality. They're also, they're a little pricey, but they're worth every penny because you're investing in your health and it will pay for itself. It will literally pay for itself. You're going to save money in the long run and also save your health. So yes, use His Glory, capital His Glory for 10% off, free shipping. I'm telling you, there's never been a deal like this and it's literally the best. So you're going to love yeah. it. That's what I liked about this because all these products are quality. Yes, they might be a little bit more than you, you get somewhere else, but you're, they're, they're, they'll last a lifetime and that's what we need. We need quality and uh, stuff that works. So Anna, thank you. Thank you for coming on and we'll see you in California. In California. Bye, guys. God bless you. All right. That wraps up today's Take 5. God bless you and go in his shalom.